Where are we? Welcome back to another race vlog. I haven't done one of these in so long and I'm glad to be at another race to put one on. I am in Alula, Saudi Arabia. Sorry if I pronounced that wrong, but it's a absolutely beautiful part of the world that I've never seen before, at least in this capacity. It feels like I'm in the middle of a scene of Star Wars or something. I'm just waiting for a pod racer to come around the corner and I'm in the middle of a scene from the movie. But the reason I'm here is for the DCL like super final, I think is what it's called. I got a call, we'll call it, from the Quad Force One team saying they need to pilot for the finals and I was available due to a couple reasons and it worked out. So I'm super excited to be here. I don't have that much experience on the DCL sim recently, that is. So I've been practicing a lot here in the room. Uh, today is day one, Monday, and the final, like the actual race is on Wednesday. So there's qualifying, there's practice and things like that, as well as a bunch of interviews and whatnot. But long story short, you guys are coming along for the week. I'm going to try and do a video a day, depending on how exciting each day is. But today's Monday. It's 8 a.m. We were all up super early, at least all the people on Quad Force One due to the jet lag and everything. And we're going to go grab breakfast, hit the gym, and uh, get ready for the day. So you guys are coming along. Hope you guys enjoy another race vlog. And uh, yeah, this view is insane. Look at that. That's crazy. All right, let's grab breakfast. Uh, quad Force <laughs> One, how do you prepare for a race? Well, what's the question? What's the question? How long do you think it would take to hit the ground? You jumped off the top of that rock. <laughs> so if you jump from up there, how long would you splatter? How long? What's the splatter time? <laughs> I need to give him like a point of reference. What was your prediction? My prediction was five seconds. About. Five? No. Dude. What, you think it's faster or slower? Definitely faster. What are your prediction? Okay, well, what did he Matt, predict before? So, I originally... He predicted like 10 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. This guy's like levitating or something. <laughs> Let's no, look this no. up. One second. Okay, so, we know we did look so it up. We, we, did, we know we the right the answer. We know we know the right answer. Okay. So we're guessing that that's like 300 feet. 350. Dude, no. No. Yeah. Way. What, how much do you think it is? That? Yeah. 300 feet. 350. No way. No. Think I think I think it's 250 max. Yeah. Okay. So look. Hmm. Wait. Stand up for us. Okay. We need a Levi for reference. So here's one Levi, Five and there it is. Yeah. Looks about. That's about 100 Levi, or no, that'd be 500 feet. No, wait, no, I'm just <laughs> 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 so, so look at like, um, at like the bottom down there, where there's like the big, like, moving truck. Okay. That's gotta be like, yeah, I guess 12 feet tall. That is, yeah, if you put it that way, it is pretty high. Okay, so call it 350, yeah, 350. Yeah, yeah. What is, what is 350, the- 350, then it would be 4.5 seconds of fall. Really? Yeah. I don't know where Levi got the. Does that start number. from zero? Like, like that includes the acceleration? Like they jump off? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Breakfast talk with Quad Force One. <laughs> really taking this serious. Here's the gym situation. Pretty nice. It's 10 o'clock right now. We don't really have anything until like 3.30. So I think we're going to work out then probably take naps because we have a dinner tonight at like 9. We all went, woke up at like 5. So got to try and beat the jet lag today. But luckily, we got some time to do it. But I'm gonna get a pump in and watch Levi jump rope. He's going for the double. Whoa! We are going to the venue right now. Apparently the PCs did not get here in time, so it's just interviews for today, which we're supposed to be split up across the next two days. But just gonna do the interviews today, go explore downtown or old town, whatever this is called. My, some of my luggage didn't get here, so I may go look for some clothes. Silas didn't bring a sweatshirt, so it's supposed to be cold. <laughs> he, we might go get some stuff. And Duncan's here, so we're gonna at least go get some Saudi Arabian Dunkin' Donuts, at the very least. But, sounds delightful. Is the Duncan close? Yeah. We found it. We found the world's smallest Duncan. Mm -hmm. It does feel like the match is, yeah, rustic. We have our Duncan. What kind of donut did you get? Uh, just glazed. Mm, keeping it simple. Have you ever seen the thing where you put the 
the donut over the straw so you can have both with one hand. Try it. Hell. <laughs> no. All the PCs and monitors. There's the stage. What a background. Dude, I'm gonna get distracted when flying and just be looking at the mountains. <laughs> it's a pretty scenic place to fly. Mm -hmm. It looks like the, it's from the cars. Like oh, you're totally right. From yeah, cars, yeah. 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 I feel like it'll be like way harder to be depressed when you crash if you just look at this. <laughs> no, this is a positive. You know what? It's yeah, not yeah. that bad. <laughs> <laughs> so they'll be able to see what, like the stream will be up here, I guess, and then we'll all be stationed like this. And this is like the pilot view. Dude, that is so cool. Yeah, you just look up for your monitor and yeah. just have this. Wow. Yeah. That's crazy. It's amazing. Okay. Is there a zoom on this thing? Oh, there it is. Beautiful. I think. What do you think of this, Levi? Yeah. Uh, well, being in the super final is definitely an honor, um, especially in a venue like this. The scenery is something that I've never raced in before, and I don't think anyone in drone racing has ever seen before. So to be here at this event is an honor, to be in the finals is an honor, and we've all prepared so much for this to try and be the DCL world champions. Uh, we're really excited. We finished interviews and nothing really else going on today. I think there's a welcome dinner. Uh, we went and shopped around. Levi, give us give us your uh, your haul. What did you get today here at the, I can't the market? I actually show it because it's Christmas presents. Oh, right. oh my gosh. <laughs> Levi got some Christmas presents. <laughs> They're pretty cool. I, I've been wanting to start a watch collection, but I don't have watch money, so <laughs> that, right that means that I don't have a watch collection. But here, it's like they're, the watches are not super expensive, but they're, you know, like, it's cooler just because you bought it next to a rock. So, check out my first ever grown-up watch. Oh, I can't tell if it's zoomed in. <laughs> there it is. I think it's pretty cool. I bought two. It was a great deal, let me tell you. And they're pretty cool. So, now the start of my watch collection started here in Alula. But we're heading back to the place. It sounds like QT just got here, so we're gonna hang out with him, practice some more tonight, and then go to the welcome dinner, hopefully. And the jet lag will... Hopefully we can stay up late enough. We will be back tomorrow. Thank you. Got the practice set up here in the room. Levi Rop just took a nap. Le QT finally made it. And uh, yeah, we basically have uh, like an hour left until dinner, but are just kind of practicing hanging out. Raiden and a bunch of the other teams just got in, so kind of hung out with them for a bit. And uh, it's like an intro dinner, so not really sure what that entails, but should have some clips of everybody kind of meeting up to say hi, get a good dinner, hopefully. And uh, then I think we're all gonna get to bed uh, after that. But we're gonna keep practicing for a little bit. We're kind of rotating off who's practicing uh, to get ready. And then, um, yeah, going to tomorrow, hopefully feeling pretty good. Okay, so we had our dinner here, team dinner. And uh, Kiki's made it to dessert and tried every single one. <laughs> Just about. So this was the green pudding. What was it like? It's kind of like a Snickers. A Snickers. Like From a liquid green Snickers. Pudding. Okay. What is this? And we got our tart. <laughs> okay. I want a one bite. Like I'll be. The Which one do you want to do? Definitely the big one. Well, the welcome dinner was a success. We are all so tired, or at least I am. And sounds like some things got delayed tomorrow, so don't even have to <clears throat> be ready to go until like 1.30 or something, which is super nice. But I'm gonna head to bed. It was a fun day, got to fly, hang out with friends, see everyone. At the end of the day, we're <clears throat> of course competitors, but seeing friends like this is really, really fun. and like. Honestly, the reason that I and everybody else does it. So, it was good, it was good. But that is the end of day one, and tomorrow we should get some practice, PC set up, finish some interviews, and then the day after that is racing, so. Thanks for watching, I'm gonna try and edit this and post it as soon as possible, but uh, yeah, stick around for more, and I'll see you soon, bye.